Hey, I was just gonna make a quick video to show you the and review the City Coco 1000 watt scooter. Um, so it's 1000 watt, 60 volt, and it has a 20 amp hour. I upgraded it to the 20 amp hour battery, and I did a removable battery, so I I bought more than one. Um, so I'll show you that battery real quick. So it's got like a key fob and all that so you can lock it and put it, set an alarm and stuff. And then it has a key to the ignition and then also a key to the battery place right here. So this comes off here. And then it has, it's a lithium polymer battery and it's in a hard case. And then just unplugs it there so you can remove the whole battery. It's 20 amp hour. I upgraded it to that. Most of them come with a 12 amp hour. But I'd rather be able to go for a longer time, you know. Okay. So some of the cool features are it has disc brakes. And not only that, it has hydraulic disc brakes. So they're hydraulic, like a motorcycle. Um, so if I turn this on real quick, it shows you, it shows it in uh, kilometers, how fast you go, and your distance from when you turn it on. It all, if you click it one more time, it has a headlight. It's got a horn, um, turning signals on the back, so you can turn those on, and then you can also turn this on for the tail light. And then it has working brake lights. Um, it has a place if you want to put mirrors on it. It came with mirrors, but I didn't like the mirrors, so I didn't put them on. Um, the reason why I went with a 1000 watt is because I live in Utah, and in Utah, 1000 watts kind of the limit for being street legal without registering it. So here's kind of a look at the front. It has front suspension. Um, it, it rides pretty smooth, those, so it has 18 inch tires, 9 inches wide, so it rides really smooth without suspension, but the suspension's nice when you're going up a driveway or something. Um, it does have a place that you can add a seat, you can put through there and have a, a second seat and a backrest, which this uh, scooter will hold 450 pounds with the rider, so. Um, so the fastest, I've got it up to 46 kilometers, which in miles, that's 28 miles per hour, which is pretty quick. Also on here, it has like a governor where you can be like first, second, or third. Third goes the fastest. Um, and I think it just governs. I don't think it really changes anything besides that. So it limits you if you put it in first or second. Yeah, so I, it's a pretty quality, I don't know, quality machine. I like it, I've had it for about a month now and, and ridden it quite a bit. But I'm in Utah and I got it in December, so it's cold outside, so I haven't ridden it too much, but it's a fun thing. Now I'll show you riding it and kind of the takeoff and, and top speed.